What am I even tripping for? Everything's gonna work out exactly the way it's supposed to. I love you 3,000. Some see Elon Musk as a real-life Iron Man. He even cameoed in Iron Man 2. Mr. Musk, how, how are you? Pepper. Congratulations on the promotion. Thank you very much. Elon, thank you. Those Merlin engines are fantastic. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Good idea for an electric jet. You do? Yeah. Then we'll make it work. I believe Tesla's share price will hit 3000 by 2025, four times its current price. And I'm not alone. Cathy Wood from ARK Invest recently said the same thing. In 2020, Tesla had 31.5 billion in revenue. I'm going to share five reasons why their revenue and share price are set to grow. Reason number one, Tesla's automotive business. They're 100% on EVs and today global EV adoption is only at 3%. It is 3% in the US, 6% in China, and 10% in Europe. That number is set to grow by 50% in 2030. Some even believe that 50% EV adoption by 2030 is quite conservative. It could be much faster. Even if Tesla loses 50% of its EV market share from 26% globally today down to 13%, that is still room to grow by eight times. That's very significant headroom just for Tesla. Today, Tesla sells every single vehicle that it manufactures. The Model Y in the US has a five months delivery time. And when a new Giga Texas and also Giga Berlin opens up in Q4 for production, that's gonna more than double their global production capacity. The Biden administration in the US is set to introduce a 7.5k EV tax credit by Q4 this year. If that happens, that's going to create insane demand for Tesla vehicles. We're now also experiencing the Model Y ramp up globally. Elon Musk believes that it is likely that the Model Y will be the world's best selling car of any type in 2022. And then we have the new $25,000 Tesla being designed and manufactured in China. That's going to be a huge game changer for Tesla because Elon Musk believes that for every 10,000 reduction in the price of EVs, demand grows exponentially. We also have the Tesla semi-trailers. Not high in mindshare, but an important market. The global long-haul freight trucking market is worth 600 billion, and Tesla is going to play in it. Imagine Tesla autopilot and full self-driving, helping with long-haul trucking, saving time and making roads safer. Next, we've got Tesla's Cybertruck. Tesla now has 1.2 million pre-orders globally, and that's worth about 80 billion in revenue. They recently delayed it to 2022, but when it launches, it's gonna give the Ford F-150 truck a good run for its money. The Ford F-150 is one of the world's best-selling trucks. Ford sells more than 900,000 of it every year, and they're also gonna introduce an electric version next year. Tesla has a gross margin on its automotive business of 26.5%. That is three times higher than the luxury auto industry average of eight, to 10%. And that number is set to grow. Tesla has unique manufacturing advantages and advantages in battery design and manufacturing. Next year, when Tesla introduces the new 4680 cells, that advantage was set to grow. Bears used to criticize that Tesla could only make profits because of their EV tax credits. Last quarter, in Q2 2021, Tesla for the first time managed to generate profits without EV tax credits. Reason number two, Tesla's energy business. The global renewable energy market's worth 1.1 trillion. Elon Musk believes that the energy business can grow as big as the automotive business. Today, it's only 7% of Tesla's revenue compared to 87% for automotive. The margins aren't great either. It is 3.6% on energy compared to 27% on automotive. Some room for improvement here would be for Tesla to reduce the cost and customization of their solar roof deployment. It's been very expensive in the past, resulting in delays and also price increases. The next opportunity is to scale Tesla's AutoBidder software, which is a trading platform to help energy companies and independent power providers to maximize revenue from trading energy. It's successfully operating right now in the Hornsdale Power Reserve in South Australia, helping to reduce energy prices. If Tesla can capture just 15% of the global renewable energy market, that's worth $150 billion. So if we take 
290 billion from automotive revenues by 2025, 150 billion from energy, that is going to be 440 billion for Tesla just from these two building blocks. That's 14 times bigger than their 2020 revenue already. Reason number three, robo taxis. By 2025, Tesla would have 10 million cars on the road. And if just 40% of their owners adopt full self-driving and pay a monthly subscription of $199, that is 4 million vehicles times 2388, which is roughly about 10 billion of high margin software revenue a year. The software industry has margins of up to 70% on average. Investors love recurring and stable revenue coming from a subscription business that full self-driving can offer. The global robo-taxi market is worth $45 billion and growing quickly. So with these three building blocks, we have $290 billion in automotive revenue, $150 billion from energy, $10 billion in high margin recurring software revenue from robo-taxis. That's $450 billion in 2025 for Tesla. Reason number four, Dojo AI supercomputer. Dojo is one of the most powerful supercomputers in the world, helping Tesla to solve computer vision. Next week at Tesla's AI Day, Elon Musk will be sharing progress on Tesla AI, both hardware and software. Its sole purpose will be to recruit the world's best AI talent. In schools around the world, engineering students flock to Tesla. They want to work for either Tesla or SpaceX. The global AI market is worth 300 billion and set to grow by 35% each year. If Tesla captures just 10% of it, that is worth an extra 30 billion of revenue each year. So we had 450 billion from earlier building blocks, adding another 30 billion from Dojo AI. That gives us 480 billion revenue. Reason number five, drones and robotics. Tesla solving computer vision will give it a huge advantage in both of these markets. For drones, they are going to serve a big role in reducing the cost of last mile delivery. E-commerce is booming worldwide. For robotics, it has a range of utility from elderly care to manufacturing. Both of these systems rely on good computer vision to understand the world around them. The global robotic and drone market is worth 300 billion by 2025. Tesla capturing 10% of that would give it an extra 30 billion. So we had 480 billion from all the earlier building blocks. We top up another 30 billion. We round up to give Tesla 510 billion of revenue by 2025. That's huge. I believe these five building blocks will help Tesla grow its revenue by 16 times from 31.5 billion in 2020, all the way up to 510 billion in 2025, and also grow its share price by four times to 3,000. Do you love Tesla 3,000? What's your target price? Let me know down in the comments below. A lot could go wrong. The share price may be flat for a couple of years before rising again. In spite of that, I believe that what could go right outweighs what could go wrong. More importantly, it feels good betting on a company that is helping change the world for the better. In an island nation like Singapore, where I live, climate change is an existential threat. Thank you for watching. Click the like button, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Tesla, I love you 3000.